Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Moore. Um, today we're going to be making Vincent Van Gogh's three sunflower collage. Things you're gonna need. Tape, like I have, or glue, glue stick, bottled glue. You're going to need scissors. You're going to need a pencil, some crayons. And you're going to need some paper. If you have colored paper, make sure you get yellow, green, whatever color background color paper you want. If not, you can always just color in some white paper. It's okay even if you have lined paper. Okay? So the first thing you're going to do, whichever paper you want as your background, go ahead and put that down. Then you're going to take a different pattern paper if you have, or like I have lined paper, and you're going to draw a vase for our flowers, okay? Your vase can look something like this. It can just be a square, whatever style you want to make your vase. Our next sheet of paper is going to be the inside of our sunflower. So you're going to draw three smaller circles, okay? If you have yellow paper, you're going to draw three larger circles on this paper, okay? If you want, you can take a cup and trace it. I just freehanded those circles. And then you're gonna need a green paper for the stems, okay, because we're going to be cutting it. So after you draw your circles on your paper, you are going to fill in the smaller circle with brown, okay, and then we're going to just draw these crisscross lines. When you draw them, it goes one way, and then you flip it the other way, okay. Those are going to be our sunflower seeds. Now after you tape or glue this part, you're going to take your scissors and you're going to cut lines, okay? They can be as far or as close apart as you want them to be. Just make sure that you don't cut that center circle, okay? So there's one done. You can bend your edges as well. Okay, so we have one of our circles done. I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of these circles. Now remember, Vincent Van Gogh liked a lot of texture in his paintings, okay? So this does not have to be perfectly smooth. They can be a little rough. I'm gonna go ahead and fill in some of these smaller circles really quick with my brown crayon. You can see here. my second sunflower.
Here it's done for. Now we're going to take the green paper and we're just going to cut some strips for the stems. And we're going to measure them. Now we don't want these stems to all be the same length. Okay, make one small, one medium, and one large. Now, you can either glue them, or like I'm doing, you can tape your stems. And you want them to overlap a little bit so that we can see our bouquet of sunflowers. And then you're going to go ahead and glue or tape your petals. After you're done here, I know you're probably wondering, well, Miss Moore, why does this look a little messy? It's okay. We're going to cover it up with our vase. So now you're going to take your vase and cut it out. And then we're just going to glue or tape this vase on top of our sunflower stems. And there you have it. Now you guys can add more detail in the vase, in the flowers, in um, where the seeds are. Okay, I just did it really quickly for you. But there is your Vincent Van Gogh inspired 